welcome back to my channel and if you're new welcome so i'm currently uploading to youtube um the video i just recorded which was creating danny and derek in the sims because i forgot to do them along with damien so there's that so now I'm going to do season eight, which has eight guys. So let's try to do this as quickly as possible. Okay, so first off is Kelly, a irrelevant character, just like Damien. Uh, Actually, there are a whole bunch of characters in season 8 that are kind of irrelevant. And that is not his old name. I did not mean to press a B. Also, on the wiki page, which is where I look at the pictures, it says that he was expelled from Smithdale when campus security found Emma's pot brownies. That's actually wrong. He wasn't expelled. He was kicked um, out of the dorms, but he was allowed to continue to go to school there. He was just not allowed to live on campus anymore. So, whoever did that does not know their facts. Um, anyway. I don't... <sighs> pick... <sighs> the last race is kind of hard. I don't know. Especially the ones we didn't really know much about um i'm just gonna give him the love he just wants to find the right person um hmm. um he's romantic i kind of want to also make him a bit smug Okay. Um, let's give him skin tone. And he has brown hair and brown eyes. Pretty easy. Guys, I'm like hungry. <laughs> I should have gotten something to eat before I started recording. I'm also. I can't stop yawning. But I'm like not tired. Ugh. What a day. And now I have to sit here and do eight Sims. Like, as much as like my channel is based on create a Sim stuff, I actually don't enjoy it. Well, I do. I enjoy creating characters, but I find it really hard to create the characters based on shows. If I like, I find it hard to like get into their shoes and see like who they are. And I, uh, I just, I don't know. Honestly, I really just, I'm really just like doing creative sims when I have new custom content to go through. <laughs> I haven't downloaded anything new. Uh, okay, he has long hair. Not that long. He kind of has the, um, the swoosh. Um, kind of. Just looking for the swoosh. Uh, I think this is the best swoosh I got. This is not the right color. And it's gotta be that. Okay. Okay, and he's kind of laid back. Um, he's from. I don't know, they said where he's from, but I don't know how I remember. 
Um, and I have the, ah, uh, no, it's not that one, but it's this one. This kind of looks like what he's wearing in the picture I'm looking at. Don't mind my yawns. And then we'll just give him some Converse. Okay, and... Ow! I moved my hand and it hit the corner of my desk. Oh, that hurt. What I was going to say was I'm actually going to do uh, the formal athletic um, sleepwear party swim hot and cold weather outfits separate. Um, um, so I'm going to do all the guys and then go back and do it myself and then I'll do the big reveal at the end. I just think that will save time and now my finger hurts guys Ugh. moving on to Johnny who he has long curly hair when he was in, when he was at the cast um, now I I don't have curly long hair but I do have long hair for guys so I'm super excited to use it because I never use it so we will do that. Um, so Johnny, and he spells his name differently than you would think. Because his name is actually J-O-N, but he spells Johnny J-O-H-N. <laughs> B Marco. Okay. Um, now... For him, now the Sims had better aspirations or be lifetime wishes, which would be like read a whole bunch of books, which I would have given him, um, because he was very very smart. I'm surprised the new pack did not did not come with a new trait, uh, a new uh, a new trait, a new aspiration. I'm gonna actually give him best-selling author, um, because even though that's not necessarily what he want, I mean I could give him. Oh, Renaissance Sim. This one, oh, maybe not. Oh, Nerd Brain, but Book Smart and Handy. Uh, I don't know. He's not really. I don't know. This one doesn't really make it. Uh, I'm going to give him that. He wants to be Book Smart. Maybe not the Handy part, but he definitely wants to be Book Smart. So I'm actually going to give him the Smart trait, which I think is under Lifestyle. Yeah. I'm going to give him Smart. He was a lot more smart. He was more smart than a lot of his friends. Most of his friends. All of his friends. But I'm also going to give him the Frenzy Rebel. So. He's got that. And then we will. I also don't. I don't think I changed. Uh, <sighs> Kelly's body type. So let me go do that real quick. Hey, he actually doesn't look too bad. I'm just gonna pull that in. Did I give him eyelashes? Yeah. Okay. Back to Johnny. He wears a lot of camo. Um. And that stuff. Um. And he has a hat. A camo hat, which I can't do, but. He's wearing one. But I can give him a hat. It's kind of like a bucket cat I guess this is what it's called I don't know I'm not really into hats I have hats just don't wear them often um and he has blonde hair which is actually more of a dirty blonde so, than a blonde blonde um yeah that's a little more like it oh uh, gotta do his eyes his eyes look ugly right now Fix that, and he has green eyes. Do that, and we'll give him some lips. Okay, now we can move on. So, I have this hair, which 
I mean, it's pretty pretty good. Um, I have I have this one just curly, but he does not have that much hair. Um, I have these, but these are actually all feminine hair. Um, so I'm just trying to find guy hair. Oh, I have this. That's a little curly. It's a little, got a little wave to it. Yeah, I think I like that. I wish it had better colors, but... Yeah, I like that. I'm gonna keep that. And then, he does have a little bit of a, um, goatee sitch going on. Um. So, just a little scruffle. Maybe we just give him some sideburns. Or maybe just like that. Yeah. I think that looks good. And then we give him his bucket cap. I'm going to call it a bucket cap because I don't know what it's called. I think we have them. At least. Oh, there it is. That's what he's wearing. Okay. It works fine, and he actually has it in camo, but I'm going to give him green. Actually, it is just a green hat. It does have a little decal, but we're not doing that. Okay, and he he's always in his camo jacket, which I don't think we can do. But I can give him a jacket that's, like, open. So let's see what we got. Well, kind of like this. Yeah, that's kind of it. Oh, and look, it's got camo. It's a little different, but A for effort, right? I think he's looking like the most similar to his character right now. So, that's good. Yeah. Okay. So moving on. So next is Bruce, who actually does not have a last name and is the only character, main character that we never learned his last name. Um, Bruce, the moose. Those are cute shoes. I think those are custom shoes, but they're cute. Okay. So, another character that was kind of irrelevant, and I hate to say, I'm going to give him the same hair I gave uh, Johnny. Because we both had long hair. Um, so, again, I forgot to do Johnny's body. Oh my god, I suck at this, guys. Actually, that's pretty good. We'll just pull that in. Okay. So, for him, I'm actually going to give him the public enemy. And I'm going to give him um, Frenzied Rebel and Slow Witted. He wasn't very bright. Okay. So, he has brown eyes and brown hair. And his skin tone is fine. We'll give him the brown eye eyebrows. That's fine. Fix his lips. I mean, I could give him this. Um. 
Yeah, I could give him that. Or I could give him this. Winner. And he's also wearing a hat, but he is wearing just a baseball cap. Yeah, like that. That looks good. Okay. And now his style. Probably a sweatshirt. Like that. Give him some jeans. And just some sneakers, I guess. Maybe these. And and I mean, he was on the football team, so we're just gonna, yeah. There. There's Bruce, the Moose. So moving on, we have Sav Bendari. And he was added, we met him in season seven, but of course he wasn't added because season eight. And he had long hair, a little, a little swoosh, <laughs> which I don't think I can, uh, recreate, but, uh, we'll try. We will try and maybe succeed. Who knows? Why does this character look so pale? He looks purple. And, uh, Sav, now, when we first met Sav, I don't really know what he wanted to do, um, but he does want to write music. Even though I didn't actually make him a musician in my Degrassi Revival series, I made him a politician, I think. Anywho, he, he's a little bit of a goofball. Um, what else? He's a music lover. Oh, and I actually have to name him Sabotage, um, because if I name him Sav, it's going to tell me that that's not allowed, because the Sims uses, um, SAV files for, um, storing, um, your saves, so it will not allow that. Um, okay, so let's work on you. I mean, actually, that hair is pretty good. Where, where is that hair from? Oh, is that... Oh, that's Max's hair. It's hard to tell because of the color, but I can see it. Okay. Anywho, we'll remove that. We'll remove that. And we will make you a normal color. Now, he is Muslim, that looks red. So he does have darker skin, but not like too dark. Ugh. I guess that's good. I really want this color, but that looks red. And these look purple. Um, maybe, maybe that. I think that looks good. And he has black hair. And brown eyes. Um, 
lashes. Did I give you eyelashes? Oh. I did not. Oh my god. I always forget this part. Okay. There. Now you have eyelashes. Let's give Sav some before I forget. Okay, and now we'll work on your hair. You got a little swoosh, and it's longer. It's not that long. Um, that actually, I mean, it's not the right way that the swoosh is going, but that's pretty similar. Maybe this. Oh, this is better. That is definitely better. I know this is the hair I gave Craig. And it actually fits Craig a little more. But, compared to all my other hairs, this one works the best. Yeah. This is definitely the winner. So, let's go work on. He just wears some t-shirts and jeans. The boys are kind of boring. Which is why I did all the girls first. But... I thought I had some banties, but I might just have downloaded them for the girls. Um, maybe just a t-shirt? Yeah. And just some jeans. Give him some converse. There's Sav. Or Savtage because I can't do his name is Sav. So again, I forgot to do his body. So let me um, do that real quick. But next we'll move on to Blue. Um, Chex, I think is how you pronounce his name. Another character that was very irrelevant. And his only purpose was making Holly J a nicer person. So, um, so, blue. Also, it's been revealed that his full name, his real name was not actually blue, um, but it was never stated in the show. Uh, he also had long hair. I don't know why all the guys this season just love a good long mange but they seem to um so um now for him even though he wasn't in the show i know what to make him because he was all he was an amazing artist um so he was creative and i think he was humble yeah so that's him um, so we'll move his hair and everything. Okay. And he's white. So we'll give him the white. I will fix that white skin because uh, I didn't even go through all the possibilities. Um, so he has dark blonde and blue eyed. And he was literally in one season, guys. That's how great of character he was. Uh, so he wasn't the best. I mean, he was a, he was an okay character, but he was kind of pointless. Kind of pointless. <coughs> so there is that. And yeah, that uh, it's a little pale. That might be better. Perfect. And he has long hair. I always want to give him this. I don't know why. It just um yeah. 
think that's gonna be the best. His hair was his hair is not that long, but I think it's the best. Yeah. And he actually did wear stuff like this. Or maybe that. That that's a little better. Let's just give him some jeans. And some shoes. And there's blue. And let me do his body. He was actually kind of muscular. Okay. So moving on to Riley Stavros. Another character who I'm going to have a difficult time doing his hair. I thought he had a curly hair, but he, oh no, he got his uh, curly hair later. So when we were first introduced, he has short hair. Hmm. Thank God. Okay. So Riley was a character who, uh, he had anger issues and I honestly did not really like him. Um, he was kind of depicted as being homophobic. And yes, I know why he was depicted that way. Because he was struggling with his own sexuality. But. I really didn't like him. Now, Zane. I love Zane. Zane is, like, amazing. You know, he was in something I was watching the other day. <gasps> he was in Nancy Drew. And I'm like, oh my god, that's Zane. And then he left the show and I was sad. But, it is what it is. Okay, so he um, is active. Uh, yeah. I wish they had another one other than Bodybuilder or this. I wish they just had one that was like, love sports. But they don't. Um, I'm actually going to make him active. Um, now, I could make him also... Uh, yeah, I'm going to make him short-tempered. He's active and short-tempered. Um, because that really was Riley. He he really did struggle with his emotions and everything. Um, and he has blue eyes and light brown hair. And he's a little tan because he is a no, he's Greek. I was going to say he was Italian. He is not Italian. He is Greek. So he's a little tan. Um, I removed that. I don't know why he's still wearing it. Um, he does have actually bu bush bushy eyebrows. I'm actually going to give him this. And he has light brown hair. So. Okay. And blue eyes is that what it said blue eyes so we'll give him that we'll give him some eyelashes and we'll give him his hair which he just has like short hair so Shouldn't be too hard. Uh, not really. Yeah. Okay, I don't think. Uh, I guess I'll do it. Okay. 
so there's Briley's face. And we'll go do his body. Um, now, he is actually pretty muscular. Especially once he started taking steroids. So, I was going to put a tank top on him because he always wears tank tops, but he mostly just wears them for, like, working out. So, I'm going to give him this, which shows his muscle, which I think he would love. And then just some jeans, some socks, and then some shoes. Um, now most likely he would wear, he probably wouldn't wear anything fancy. He would wear something where he can just, like, run in. So, there's Riley. So I got two more to do. So, first is Casey. Um... Do him. So, Casey. Guthrie. Um, he just wants a family. That's really what he wants. He just wants a successful lineage. Even though he's a teen. He, he wanted Tyson. He didn't want to give Tyson up. Um. Uh, I'm going to make him hot-headed instead of short-tempered. Because, like, he only got angry when things didn't go his way, and it was very rare. Riley got angry a lot more, and he was more of a short-tempered, but I think he was definitely friendly trouble. Um, so, actually, instead of frenzy rebel, because he doesn't, uh, because his mom wasn't in the picture. I'm actually going to make him smart. And hot headed. I need to find where hot headed is. Hot headed. Where where's hot headed? Would it be in the same spot? There it is, hot-headed. And a lot of the traits that I give these people, I I do change once they have a family. Because by, when they were added to the cast, they're completely different people by the time they left the show. So. These traits, definitely, for KC, um, I mean, he stayed smart, but his hot-headed trait really did um, change. So, and KC used to be one of my favorite characters. Um, he, I had a huge crush on him, um, and I loved him. And him and Gemma, Jenna were my favorite couple and I once um, actually um, tweeted to um, um, uh, Jessica Tyler that she was my favorite um, character and she actually responded back saying thank you. And I was like, oh my god. Um, so he has hazel eyes, which I don't like using any of my other custom eyes. I love the noodles, which I always use. I, I have no idea um, what hazel means anyway. So I'm getting light brown. But yeah, so that's just a little fun fact. And I was like starstruck. I was like, oh my god, she actually responded. Because I responded to a whole bunch of celebrities. 
know. I mean, I've tweeted other celebrities, not a whole bunch. I've tweeted other celebrities, and she's the only one that's ever replied, and I was starstruck. So, um... So the hair I gave Kelly, I'm also going to give him, I know it's weird, I'm giving them both the same hair style. Maybe I should give him that. Yeah, I'm going to give him that. Yeah. So yeah, that's just a little, a little fun fact. I was over the moon. That's not it. Where? Apparently I can't change hat. I thought I could. Oh, well. Um, so Casey. I know I'm not, like, giving anybody any <laughs> any jewelry. Uh, this is why I suck. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna give him a sweatshirt. Yeah, that kind of works. I'll give you some pants, some socks, and you were a skater when we first met you, so I'm actually going to give you the skater shoes. Um, if I can find them. Um... Oh, there they are. So I'm going to give you the skater shoes. Um, in black. There. There's KC. Okay, so the last one I'm going to do before I step off and do all of their other outfits myself, and I forgot to do KC's body type, but is Connor Delarier. Um, yeah, so Connor was also added in season eight. Okay, so he's a very slim guy. Of course, he was on the football team and everything, and the basketball team, but um, he was very slim. Um, so, let's do Connor. And I'm really excited for this because I have a custom trait specifically for Connor. Okay. So, for Connor, he definitely wanted to be, um, can be, uh, maybe not, maybe he wanted to be good at many things at once, that seems like him, and uh, I can give him one of my mental health traits, which, well, technically, autism is not a mental health. I can give it to him. If I can find it. I'm not lying. I do have an autistic trait. Actually, I think it's specifically Asperger's, too. Give me a second to find it. I will. Maybe it's under lifestyle. Social, maybe? Oh my god. Mm. 
my god. If it's like right in front of me and I'm just not seeing it. I know I have it. Okay, so I cannot find that trait. I have a couple of mental health traits. Um, and I'm going to try to find a replacement autism trait. Um, so... I don't know why it's not showing up. Because even if it's broken, it should still show up. That's the part I'm not getting. I don't know. I'm gonna. I'm looking one more time. But I don't think it's been updated. So it's not in the game, so I'm going to make him, um, I don't know. <sighs> I don't know what to make him now. I was so excited to. I'm making him asocial. I don't know. But he's a genius. I'm so upset too. Because I remember seeing it. For the longest time. And I went and looked to see maybe it's just teens. But it's not even showing up for children. So I'm going to try to find... Um, and I asked in Discord, so we will see. Um. So he has brown eyes and black hair. So that's fine. And his eyes are fine. Also, he has a afro. Yay. Because that's not troubling to figure out. Mm. Probably gonna have to be that one. Yeah, okay. Now for his outfits. 
He wore the same thing every day. It was a sweatshirt. <clears throat> so. Just like that. And jeans. Socks and some shoes. And there is Connor. And I'm going to try to get the treat if I can. But now I'm going to go and do their outfits. Okay, so I have given them all outfits. Um, unfortunately, I was not able to get an autism or Asperger's uh, trait. I am going to have to go through my traits and figure out what is going on. Um, what I might do is take a picture of the traits that are definitely showing up. And that's actually what I think I'm going to do. I'm going to take a picture of the traits that I have showing up for all of my um, genders and everything. And then go through the ones that aren't showing up. So it's going to take me a while, but I'm going to try to figure it out. I'm uh, someone suggested an idea and I'll try it. But anyway, so this is Kelly Ashuna. He has a soulmate aspiration. He's alluring, romantic, and a bit smug. So this is his everyday. Then we have his formal. Now I got really tired of dressing them up. So a lot of them are have the same clothes on and they're very repetitive and just wasn't fun but this is his active sleepwear party swim hot weather and cold weather moving on to Johnny DeMarco he is a nerd brain. He is a quick learner, smart, and a frenzied rebel. So this is his everyday, formal, active, sleepwear, party, swim, hot weather and cold weather so then Bruce the Moose is public enemy he is dastardly frenzy rebel and slow witted so this is his everyday formal athletic sleepwear Party, swim, hot weather, and cold weather. So then Sav Bandari, a musical genius, he is a muser, a goofball, and a music lover. So this is his everyday, formal, athletic, sleepwear, party, Swim, hot weather, and cold weather. So next we have Blue Checks. He is a painter extraordinaire, muser, creative, and humble. So this is his everyday formal. 
active sleepwear party swim hot weather and cold weather and then Briley Stavros is a bodybuilder he has high metabolism active and a little bit of a short tempo temper <clears throat> So this is his everyday party active sleepwear party swim hot weather and cold weather. So then Casey Guthrie has one successful lineage. He's domestic, smart, and a little bit of a hothead. So this is his every day. We have formal, and I try to base the formals, well, I try to base all the outfits kind of on their personality. So then we have Casey's active, and I know his hair color changed. That's the hair that's under the hat, but I don't know why Anto didn't do the same colors. Then we got sleepwear, party, swimwear, hot weather, and cold weather. So then Connor Deloria, which he is a renaissance sim, quick learner. A social and genius and I wanted to give him that autism trait but I just was having issues so I also forgot to put his glasses on so I did add his glasses so this is his um, everyday look and now because Connor um, in season 8 and I believe season 9 I don't think it was until season 10 he wore the same outfits every day and he also wore the same outfit for um, his formal, I th I'm pretty sure when they went to the dance, he was still wearing his sweatshirt and jeans. So, for his formal, I gave him that. Then active, he's wearing the sweatshirt, but he does put on some active pants. Sleepwear. Party, he's back into the same outfit. Swimwear, he does have a bathing suit. And then we got hot weather, which he wears it. And cold weather so that's them so I hope you enjoyed today's video if you did go ahead and give this video a like I know there was a lot of technical issues and I'm gonna try to get my traits sorted out um, but I will see you all in my next video bye